Uh, creatively, the way things are composed, for the most part, it's actually very similar because the kind of compositions that we do here are sort of like big and epic and grandeur and all that kind of stuff for the types of shows that are done here. And so what's sort of funny is that we're able to, you know, we even went back to a lot of uh, shots or a lot of compositions that were created and just converted them into stereo and they let themselves naturally. There was a few little tweaks of the camera, a little bit of convergence uh, stuff that had to be dealt with, but otherwise it lent itself really naturally. So for the most part, the actual aesthetic of the shots uh, stays pretty much the same. It's just that, you know, when you're constructing a composition from stereo, uh, from scratch, you just keep a few things in mind, sort of like how close you could place objects to the camera, how close your camera is going to be to something, you know, you don't want things uh, creeping in too close to the camera and all that kind of stuff. But generally, um, it's pretty straightforward and, and we're also using some great scripts that speed up the pipeline of the work here. Um, so generally, um, you know, uh, aside from a few new rules that you kind of have to uh, throw into the uh, blender, uh, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty good.